Today, I will show you how to create Hollywood-grade AI films with just one tool, Nim. Let's jump right in. First, open Nim.video from the link in the description and log into your account. Under the Explore section, you will find videos and images sorted into categories. From the top right, you can filter by video to see what other users have created. Click on any video and you can see the prompt used, the negative prompt, and the model used to create it. And just look at the quality of the animation. Can you tell it's AI generated? And the best part, you can click the reuse input button to modify the prompt, change the video model and the aspect ratio to create your own version of the video. On the top left, the create tab gives you one click access to these game changing tools. I'm going to walk you through each of these powerful features as we create an AI film from scratch using Nim.video. So let's jump right in. First, we need a story. If you already have a script, you can skip to the next chapter. But if not, here's the fastest way to create one. Open ChatGPT and paste this line. Now, replace this part with the story idea you have in mind. I will enter this story about a boy and a spell book. Hit enter, and in moments, ChatGPT will give an exciting story with scene-by-scene -scene image prompts. Scroll up and copy the first prompt then go back to nim.video. Starting with text to image, first, we will convert our script into stunning visuals. Under the profile icon, hit projects. Quickly create a project and name it. Let's call it AI film, so everything stays organized. Now, in the prompt box, paste the prompt you copied from ChatGPT. Select the image tab and click the model dropdown to choose from eight different image models. I will go with Flux Pro. Then pick 16 to 9 aspect ratio for perfect cinematic shots. Hover over the three dots and enable auto enhance prompt for better results. Finally, we can randomize the seed number from here. Hit generate, and in just seconds, our first AI powered scene is ready. Notice the crisp details, cinematic lighting, and professional grade composition that would normally take hours to achieve manually. Repeat this process for each scene prompt to generate the full storyboard but ChatGPT gave us only a few image prompts. So, I use this prompt to expand each scene into two to three shots. And that's how you can turn a basic story into a rich, cinematic sequence. I will put the prompts in the description below. Now let's turn these images into animations, and you won't believe how easy it is. Before we animate, let's see how to reverse engineer a video style with one click. On the top left, hover over Create and click Describe. Upload your image or video, and Nim AI will instantly generate a prompt that can create a similar image or video. So, let's test it out. Just below are the text to image and text to video buttons. I will select text to video, and we will land in this interface. You can customize the prompt, swap the video model, or adjust the aspect ratio, but for now, I will stick with the defaults and just add the young boy from our first scene into the prompt. Hit generate, and here is the result. In seconds, we have transformed a simple clip into a brand new scene. This level of control is a game changer for AI filmmaking. If you need a specific character, just click the character reference button and upload the character's image. This way, your character will stay on model across every scene. Now, let's turn the images into videos. Start by selecting the image you'd like to animate. At the bottom left, you will find the image to video button, tap it, and Nim AI will seamlessly upload and analyze your image. Even better, it generates a ready-to-use prompt for you, taking the guesswork out of the process. If the prompt isn't quite what you wanted, simply hit rewrite, and Nim will craft a fresh one for you. Or, if you have a specific prompt in mind, feel free to type your own custom prompt. Now, here's where the fun begins. Click Add to unlock advanced prompt presets, where you can fine-tune details like lighting, style, facial expressions, VFX, and more. For example, click on Character Action, and you can pick from a variety of preset movements like shrugs, jumps, or scratch his head. Try them out yourself. There are endless possibilities for every element. Next, hover over the three dots and enable Auto Enhance Prompt. Under Prompt Style, select Dynamic for enhancing the actions and camera motion. Then, you can pick from video models like WAN, LTX, Luma, Minimax, Kling 2, or Pika. I will go with Kling Pro for this one. Then you may edit the negative prompt and adjust the video length between 5 to 10 seconds. But all models don't support this feature. And one thing I really love about Nim is that it provides default prompts for everything. Once everything's set, 
hit generate. And here is the result. How cool is that? But something's missing. That's right, dialogue. A character without a voice can feel a little empty. But we can fix that in seconds. In the bottom left corner, click on lip sync. This tool automatically matches your character's mouth movements to the audio. Once your video is uploaded, you can click the sound tab to upload an audio file. Or under text tab, type in your script. I will enter this text and select a pre-made voice. But here's the cool part. You can upload a sample voice to clone it and make your characters sound like anyone you want. Now hit generate, and once it's generated, your silent character will talk like a real actor. Finally, let the old world fear what wakes. But here's the catch. Without sound effects, your scenes will feel flat. Adding sound is easy. Just click add sound in the bottom left, or go to create, add sound, and upload your video. Then describe the sound you want for the video and click write with AI. Or leave it blank and Nim will analyze the video and suggest sound effects. If you are not happy, just click rewrite for fresh suggestions. Below is the audio model, and under more controls, you can enter the negative prompts to exclude unwanted sounds. Once done, hit generate, and the sound effects will be generated. And here's the sound combined with the dialogue. Finally, let the old world fear what wakes. Now, let me show you how to upscale a video. Click this upscale button and the interface will open. Select the model drop down and choose either Topaz for best quality or standard for fast and budget friendly upscale. Next, pick your desired resolution you want to upscale to. But there is a warning. This video is too large for this resolution. That's because NIMS videos are already high resolution by default. So unless you are working with low resolution footage from your computer, you probably don't even need to upscale. That said, let's boost the frame rate just for fun and hit generate. And there we go. As expected, there will be no difference, but fast moving scenes will be much smoother. And here is the default resolution for your reference. Now, repeat all the above steps to convert the images into videos, add dialogues, sound effects, and upscale them. For even more creative options, head over to Restyle, upload a video, and from here you can transform your video into one of these breathtaking artistic styles. Now, once all your clips are ready, head to the top right and click Story to enter the editing workspace. Click this button to add all your prepared clips. Arrange them just how you want. Then click Download All, and here is the result.